What's good, everybody? It's your brother, Mad Black, the most dangerous and most toxic black man on the internet. And I am black up in your face again with some more pro black commentary. So, as promised, I wanted to do this video, you know, because there's always so much nonsense when it comes to black relationships on social media, whether it be on YouTube, TikTok, or Instagram. You would think that black men and black women don't love each other or that black men and black women don't have relationships. But the thing is, what you're seeing actually is you have a lot of, uh, just a lot of bitter and moronic people out there who are not really honest about what goes on in their own life and their own relationships, or maybe not honest about their own shortcomings. So they just blame the other gender for everything. And they like keeping this gender war thing going on and on and on and on. And a lot of it is is become profitable for them. So, of course, they want to keep up the lie that this gender war is the most all-consuming thing in the black community or just in their own life, right? But I found that there are plenty of black couples on YouTube, but you never really see them because, you know, or you don't pay as much attention because it just kind of passes through your brain or passes by your eyes, right? You you think you've been so consumed with the gender war yourself or you think it's such a real thing that you really don't pay attention that there are plenty of black couples on YouTube uh, maybe not doing relationship videos. They might just do, be doing reaction videos or, you know, there are black couples who watch anime or there are black couples who watch movies and react to them or, or watch TV shows and react. There are black couples who listen to different types of music and react. There are black couples who listen to different types of comedy and react. So there are different types of channels out there. And, you know, I want to kind of showcase a little bit of a database that I kind of compiled of some black couples out there that you can watch. And like I said, perfectly functional couples getting along just fine. And, you know, you can go watch them if you want to watch something that doesn't really have anything to do with the gender war nonsense. You, and you can see a functioning black couple getting along just fine. So I made the database and it's, it's 10 YouTube channels that you can go to. And it's in the description box and it's pinned in the comments section. And you can check the link. Some of these you might already know. You know, a lot of you might actually be fans of these couples already. But I wanted to showcase them here. And what I'm going to do is just kind of go over my top four because I don't want to go through all of them. I want you guys to go discover them for yourself. But I'll go through the top four that I probably watch the most out of all of these channels. OK, and starting with the one I've probably been watching for the longest, and that is Married to the Real. And, you know, I've been watching this black couple forever because they watch a lot of the same type of pop culture stuff that I watch. You know, they watch Stranger Things. They watch Game of Thrones. They they watch a lot of anime. They watch cartoons. Every you know whatever you can think of. They play video games, and you know they collect toys as well. So I've been watching them for a long time. Plus, I just you know I like their chemistry. They're very funny to me. Uh, the wife Tasha, she reminds me actually a lot of my older sister, just in the way that she talks and how she responds. To certain things like that, it very much reminds me of, you know, my older sister or some of her friends or whatever. So, I you know, I appreciate this channel a lot. And like I said, I like their 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 banter back and forth is usually pretty funny. Like just the other day, they were reacting to an episode of Game of Thrones and some of the naysayers or idiotic comments that they got. The husband was kind of imitating those people and and. The wife, Tasha, was kind of answering those questions. It, it, it was funny to me, like the voice he was doing of some of the idiotic comments that they get and her response to it was it was, it was funny to me. So uh, if you like that type of content, I would recommend going to watch their channel. Uh, probably the next one that I watch the most is Kid and C Reacts. Now, I kind of discovered them over the, the pandemic. So for me, it's almost kind of like, you know, a, a newer channel that I watch and I started watching them just to relax. And I started watching like a lot of their joke reactions 
but they also do reactions to like either scary videos or true crime videos. And it's actually been pretty, you know, interesting seeing their take. And they're also, you know, I, I might be a little biased because they're kind of from my neck of the woods. I think they're, they live in Memphis, but I, I've enjoyed watching their, their responses to, you know, stuff that's funny, but also stuff that's serious. So I guess if you're into true crime or things like that, I, you know, I recommend going to watch, you know, their channel. They do very good reactions. Um, another thing that I like about them as a couple is the fact that they they often talk about how they their families knew each other and they knew each other before they got together. Like they did, they, you know, knew each other through high school and college, but didn't get together till after college. So they always talk about, you know, would they be a couple had they gotten together sooner? Or did they have to go through some things in life first and kind of have more understanding of themselves before they got together? And I, I think that's a very interesting question and a, a very interesting way to form a relationship. And you can see their relationship is almost more like not just a uh, boyfriend, girlfriend. It's almost like a, a, a tight friendship. You can tell that they've known each other for a long time. They even talk about each other's families and what each other's family members have gone through. So you can see it's a, a, a great relationship on screen and, I, and I, I appreciate their channel. I've been watching them for a while. They're, they're one of the channels I watch to relax. Uh, another channel that is very similar that I, I watch to relax is Dub and Nisha. Now these two, for, for some of you are probably familiar with Dub because he is one of the creators of In The Clutch. And there are, I know a lot of black males, a lot of young black males are fans of In The Clutch where it's Dub and his friends Ross and you know, was the Trill Billy used to be on there, but I think it's just Dub and Ross now. But uh, but yeah, but but Dub also does a a channel with his wife Nisha, and I I enjoy seeing their channel. First of all, I just enjoy them for being a young couple who have a, a young family, like they have children as well, and I I just love seeing that. I love seeing young black couples out there and young families, and the fact that you know they have so much love and appreciation for each other. And wanting to build, like I, I hear that theme all the time. You like the little theme song that they put together for their channel. That's that's the theme of it is wanting to build it and be greater and be better. I can tell, you know, Dub is a blue collar brother, but he wants to do more than just that with his life. And I can appreciate that being a young man. He has a you know young family and wanting to do better for his family. And I think he's doing a great job of it so far. And, you know, they do a lot of different reactions to comedy skits or, you know, different people's YouTube channels, or prank calls, or whatever. It's, it's a, like I said, it's a channel that I watch to relax, because it's funny seeing them, you know, react to things and laugh. So if you're into that type of content, go right ahead and sub to that channel. And channel number four on my, my list that I want to give here is your boy Roshi. The brother on the end of the couch with the glasses, that's Roshi's best friend. So they've been friends forever, so he's always on the channel. But uh, next to him, or on the other side of him, is his wife, Shira. So Shira and Roshi, they have a family, very beautiful young family. It's always awesome to see them. I remember when, uh, I think I started following them when she first got pregnant, I think with their second child. So it was interesting watching the channel and, you know, seeing them go through that as a young family, but also seeing them still do their own content where they watch anime or they watch different, you know, American animated shows or they watch or they play video games or, you know, just watch fantasy shows or sci-fi. And, you know, it, it's good to see that. I, I, I love seeing young couples and I, I love seeing these two together. It's, it's an amazing thing to see. They're a, a beautiful family. It's a, it's a cool channel. So for you brothers out there that, Say you can't find a black girl that likes anime. There are black women out there that exist that way. You just got to find them. And they won't be just dissing you or calling you a nerd or, or a loser or whatever. You know, this brother was able to find one and marry her. And they have a family together. So everything seems to be working out just fine for them. So, you know, you just got to go out there and find the person that's right for you. And not always pursue what the mainstream says you should be pursuing or, or, or these social media buffoons or gurus 
who don't even have a woman what they say you should be pursuing as a man. So those are just the top channels that I you know normally watch all the time, but I'm giving you a top 10 as well for you guys to go, you know, to go watch and just check out and like I said if you want to find some different types of you know content out there, not just gender war content or not just political content. There are black couples out there that do different types of content and you can go watch them and watch them interact or react to whatever they're watching in their videos. So this is just the start of it. There's some other things that are some other content channels that I'll probably put out there. This one I want to focus mainly on the couples. There are other YouTube channels where it'll be a black man and a black woman who are in a relationship that are on the channel, but usually it's it's really one of their channels and they just like feature their wife or their their husband every once in a while. You know what I mean? So they don't have their their spouse in the videos all the time, but I want to focus mainly on the ones that do have their their spouses in the video all the time. They're almost like a team doing these videos uh, 24-7. So you folks can go check them out. The links will be in the description box as well as the comment section. Anyway, Mad Black, and I will be back with my foot on these devil's back.